Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Hide and seek. Let's go hide and seek. I think that.
Grace, you need to get some food. Yeah. Sorry. Tell them why you're 
you can ask yourself individually, did you get better? Because if we all get better on our day, that one little thing, just a little simpleness, maybe it's one of the things here and there.
I restore bed plastic rather than just clean. And I do it in no time at all. I apply white meat bumpers, side panels, even dashes, and interior plastic. You simply apply it once and it lasts for years. White New is the most revolutionary oh, car care product that I've used in my entire detailing career. We have tried to use fluid wipers, sign of this vehicle. We then sent this car to a little bit more than 100 hours. White New never faded or washed away. But the results will last for years of real world environmental exposure. I've never seen a shower. I've never seen a shower. I've never seen a shower. And we guarantee it will last for years. Uh, 
come back when we have a team of it. Okay, that's fine. Cool. Go get him. I don't know why I can't get him. Oh, 
my Christ. You know that, right? Yeah, you know that. 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 Yeah, you know that.
They used to come to my restaurant. Maybe in Turkey chili. Ow. No, I'm not. Sorry, I couldn't just, I couldn't just, but just to do that. Part. Excuse me, uh, I think you forgot my bread. You want bread? Three now. Someone else is. Sometimes the players, players kind of get stuck in molds 
they know they don't use their own minds, and I think that he, he's working with the youngsters on developing, you know, skills to yeah, yeah. you know, those years and yeah. years, you know, as rookies, you know, and I think that that's something that this team absolutely needs. Well, the Houston defense to start out last year fantastic, but as a, the season went on, they really kind of fell down. It's reflective of the record in December, also the playoff disappointment. The defense was good to start, but really struggled down the stretch. Those numbers tell a pretty good story. Who tells a better story? Aaron Rodgers, Peyton Manning, Tom Brady, and four games combined against that Texas defense. 15 touchdowns and zero interceptions. Is it going to be any better this year? They should do better. They can get Donnie better and healthier. We talked about getting an Ed Reed uh, last year. They had a player like Jonathan Joseph that was pretty much dealing with injuries throughout the majority of that season. Uh, they lost Dante Robinson free agency, so they have Kareem Jackson, the young player, who should come and step up and play better. But to me, it's not just Ed Reed, it's going to be those cornerbacks. They have to pretty, pretty much solidify that path because Ed Reed will bring a present. Uh, I think Christian coming back will bring a present. But overall, it's going to be up to those corners to man up those receivers because Wade Phillips likes to be aggressive and the defensive play caller. You have to have guys that can cover. The Texans have uh, realistic Super Bowl expectations. Is that defense good enough to go along with that level of expectation? I think they are. They can make their play at the right time, similar to the guy on the opposite side of the line and their quarterback. I know they can play at the right time. I think it's going to be the quarterback. But the defense, they have to kind of be there at the end to make some plays and get the best player on defense in the entire league. And J.J. Watt, so I expect that they already be able to make plays and adding cushion, adding dead rings, and adding playmakers to a defense that's already played pretty well. Well, the Giants recently uh, proved they had the playmakers of course, football to make it to the Super Bowl and win. But last year, I remember last year, they didn't even make the postseason. Sean O'Hara, former Super Bowl winning center with Tom Coughlin and the Giants, was one-on-one -on -one with his former coach coming up next. I was frightened, very frightened. This is a woman you love all of your life. I don't want to live in this house without you. Having told her with me, you comfort me and support me. You can't learn enough about kids in a short period of time. Doctor, doctor, I don't know what to do. I need help. Once we decided to go with the of America, my level of fear I thought I needed to do something in addition to conventional training. What I do is talk medicine, surgery, and I don't know much about supporting therapies. But I realized with cancer, you don't just go in and take the standard. There's things you can do that are going to enhance the therapy. I also said it was quite a bit of an education for me. Cancer treatment centers of America was using so many advanced tools. That's how they handle this cancer. If you are someone who lost a school list for advanced stage cancer, go to cancercenter.com. You'll see how our treatment results compare to national averages. And meet our experienced physicians and clinicians who dedicated their lives to fighting cancer. Visit cancercenter.com to learn why over 95% of our patients are satisfied and to see if you are one of the hundreds of insurance plans with which we work. I have every confidence in what they are doing for my job. This is the centers of America's chorus now. You have every reason to hope. Call or go to cancercenter.com. Cancer treatment centers of America. Care the lucky one who gets a point out of the man now. This is Ed and Bill Rizzo. We're in the middle of seven hours of nonstop football. Let's go live to Washington for our G3 players to see if it looks out of Seattle. Can they find a wide open for Davis? And then for the last play of the game, Andrew Luck dumps it off. He's in. Colts win. Colts win. First time watching the NFL Rizzo. We're live on Sunday afternoons. Every touchdown from every game. Find out more at NFL.com slash Rizzo TV. Hey, it's me, Progressive Insurance. You know, from our 4,000 television commercials. Yep, there I am with the other one. Watch it. <laughs> Anywho, 3 million people switched to me last year, saving an average of $475. Yeah, I'm kind of a big deal. 
25 real ice cream shakes are half price after 8 p.m. This is how you stomach. Today, we're at a salon to see how people react to getting a shampoo. Without water. Have nothing. You can't clean your hair without water. Baby, see you tomorrow. Woo! Thank you. 
to me the crayon. It's pink wood, my color color it. Oh, my favorite color. Do I have to put that? Na, 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 na. Are you sure it's right? Yep, yeah, I'm sure. They're off. So it's time for yellow. Yeah. That helps me miss someone. That helps me miss someone. So what time do you want to get together later? What? That helps me miss someone. That helps me miss someone, Grace. Oh, that helps me miss someone. So we're not going? Come on, Two colors. Two colors. Two colors. Two colors. Two colors. Two colors. Population. Twister!
happened. He must have been an accident. Accident. This was no accident. These dogs were murdered. <laughs> trained dove. She does this magic act. That was her talent for the pageant. You know what I think, Jerry? I think somebody murdered those doves. Somebody wanted her out of that contest bad. Somebody who was just eaten up with jealousy. Somebody who couldn't stand at the spotlight taking off a gun. What are you looking at? Oh, that we, uh, we had to leave that outside last night because the water was making the room too cold. But, uh, you killed them, didn't you? No, you don't understand. It's not what you think. It was an asshole. Oh, don't think that you won because you have it. This kid is a fighter. And if you think I'm going to let a couple of dead birds get in our way, you're crazy. What was that all about? No, it's just Kramer. Apparently, I killed Miss Rhode Island's dogs with a bucket of water last night. <laughs> Delight in each delicious moment with all the refreshing possibilities from the cafe. Our review is just a smoothie and delectable cafe with a break when you're in there. And it all starts with a sip. There's something for everyone to love from the cafe. And he kept saying Jocelyn. Is that his name, Jason? Two years is too long to wait. Introducing Junk from T Mobile. Upgrade when you want, not when you're told. Sarah likes fast food lunch, but also wants to save. A lunch like this from Walmart is less than a dollar fifty. Wow! If you switch out fast food lunch just twice a week, you can save over four hundred and seventy bucks a year. Four hundred and seventy bucks? That's a lot of money. Save on hot pocket sandwiches, back at a low price guarantee. Walmart. Closed captioning provided in part by. <laughs> Yes, it's so that glow. Aren't you sweet? Legends phone apps available 24-7. Call 1-800-PROGRESSIVE. They say it was during an arm wrestling match that Mr. Clean realized the way to handle bigger, tougher messes was better leverage. That's why he created his new Magic Eraser Handy Grip. It has a handle that firmly attaches to the eraser, so you get better leverage and more oomph with less effort. It's the perfect Magic Eraser for making stuff that's big and tough. Not so tough after all. Mr. Clean's Handy Grip, the newest member of the Magic Eraser family, in all purpose and back. Mm. Now get 50% off any Domino's pizza when you order online. 50% off sausage pizzas, specialty pizzas, even barbecue banana pepper pizzas. If you're into that, this week only get 50% off the menu price of 34 million pizza combinations at Domino's.com. On August 9th, it's Disney's play. Yeah, that's gonna leave a mark. The of the world of cars. You got to get me. And disgusting. I'm afraid of heights. Awkward. Disney's play. In 3D, August 9th, rated PG. Why did LG dream up a large capacity refrigerator with a door built into the door? So you can enjoy easy access to the things you use most. Olive Garden's two for 25 is ending soon. Choose two appetizers, two entrees, and unlimited salad and breadsticks. When you go Olive Garden, and now get your exclusive buy one entree, get one half off coupon at olivegarden.com slash offer. Be the hero? Peter can be your knight in shining armor. Go, go, gadget ski! Back to back to the Coming up next, on TBS. Very funny. <laughs> Okay, this is it. How do you feel? I'm a little nervous. There's nothing to be nervous. But 
but I've never spelled before in my life. Karen is handsome, Miss Romine. Peter, we've been over this. There has to be a World War III and four first. 
I don't, I don't miss a view, you World War Five, Lois. It's so intense, it skips over the other two. Tina, is that the what? I have spoken! <laughs> <gasps> There's Connie D'Amico. Chris, don't walk next to me. Hi, Connie. Uh, so I heard you talking in the hall the other day about how much you like High School Musical 2, so I burned you the soundtrack. Okay, prepare for itemized insults. A. Don't ever listen to me talk. You don't deserve my work. B. When I said I enjoyed it, I was speaking ironically. And C. You actually like High School Musical? What are you, eight? No, that's impossible because I've seen that big hairy mud flap ass of yours in the locker room. Question? Hey, Meg, take that! <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. The show's kind of on us, because we're smelling it. Yeah! Awesome! Oh, awesome. 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 Scott is such an idiot. I'm totally breaking up with him. I'm going to switch to one of the other popular guys. But, Connie, you've gone out with, like, every popular boy in this school. Ugh, yeah, you're right. God, they all suck so much. I need a new challenge. What if? Now, bear with me on this. What if I date a loser and make him over into a popular guy? Wow, great idea. I'm glad I hung in there. Now, who are the biggest losers in the school? Oh, well, they're Smiley McGee. Hello. Nah, I hear he's a bedwetter. And Chris Griffin? Oh, my God. I can smell him from here. He's perfect. God, you're right. He smells like Fred Flintstone's ass. Hey, no one's asking you to smell it. <laughs> All right, Stewie, your dad's going to help you learn how to be a man. Real men have a couple of beers and then project their inadequacies on their kids. Okay. What's that? You think you're better than me? What? No, I didn't say that. So I guess you think you would have been some kind of big chef by my age, huh? Done things differently? Got that promotion? I don't even know what you do. Well, let me tell you something. You're nothing. And you're never going to be nothing. Now, let's sit here and watch Spike TV. Spike TV. Full of stuff men like. <laughs> Peel and a picture of mom eating a tricky leg. <gasps> oh my god, Connie's coming over to talk to me. And then I'm straight. Hey Meg, nice posture. Get lost. Thank you. Chris Griffin, you are undoubtedly the most unpopular boy in school. I am? Well, what about Smiley McGee over there? Hello. You and I are going on a date Saturday night. Oh, okay. I'll see you then. Why would she go out with me? She must be more drunk than Santa Claus when he got that DUI. Oh, no, it wasn't my fault. Some guy in a Plymouth totally cut me off. Sir, they don't make Plymouths anymore. Are you Jewish? Sir, I'm going to need you to step out of the sleigh. All right, Stewie, we're going to get you nice and pumped up. Now, you see that barbell over there? Go ahead and try and lift that. Uh-oh, Spadoodio. I noticed your kid is having some trouble. You're telling me. Oh, your kid just needs a little help. I got something that'll get him going. Well, if there's anyone I can trust, it's a stranger at the gym holding a dirty needle. Here, Stewie, try this. Yeah, what the hell are you doing? Well, oh my. Suddenly I'm full of energy. All right, fat man, let's do this.
back this can and wait until after eight again. Anyone need the remote? Oh my god, what the hell happened to Dewey? Yeah, what's good, doesn't he? See that lesbo Susie Swanson beat him up now. Wait a minute, how do you know she's gay? Short haircut, stubby lights, doesn't respond to my advances. You haven't answered my question. Why the hell does Dewey look like this? Well, I took him to the gym and the colorful jet there advised me that I put him on steroids. And you listen to him? Yeah, I believe everything everyone tells me anyway. <laughs> Good on, d What the heck? Stewie, you look gross. You look like Lou Ferrigno's poop. I look like a guy who's been hitting the gym. It has nothing to do with the gym. You're on drugs. No matter how you find the particles, be to the right. All that matters is that you beat the leprechaun. That doesn't make any sense. Doesn't have to make sense when you look like this. <clears throat> I am hotter than phone sex with a blind girl. You sound hot. What are you wearing? I don't know. <laughs> Classic Rock 103.7 WHTT. I hate this station. They always make promises they can't deliver. Playing the greatest rock and roll hits of all time. Without this day. Chris, turn that off. We have a lot of work to do before we go inside. All right, if I'm going to be seen with you, we have to do something about that look. Now take that hat off. Oh, God, your hair's all combed. Here, let me fix that. All right, good. Now, let's give you a pencil-thin douchebag beard. Oh, yeah, that's like a rake. No, you look like you don't care, and that's good. Oh, okay. Um, if we're dating, does that mean when we go in there, I can hold your hand? Good idea. Then everyone will think you're popular. Well, I don't really care about that. I want to hold your hand because I like you. I don't understand. Well, I think you're nice, and I like spending time with you. You're really pretty, and I hope I get to be with you for a long time. Wow. Um, nobody's ever said anything that nice to me before. Well, maybe you've been hanging around with jerks. Yeah, maybe I have. Hey, forget the pep rally. You want to go see a movie? Cool. Maybe we could go see that Chad Palm and Terry Paul's or, you know, movie, Distracting Trumpet. I want to thank you all for coming out here today. We got a serious situation down in the Bronx. Our friend needs to get a message to the short man in the hat. He needs to deliver this message before the construction site contracts are handed down. It's of vital importance that these matters be attended to. So we may have to bring in our friends from your turn. Huh? I say we may have to bring in our friends from your turn. Hey, what the hell? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is there a problem? Huh? You want to go? You want to go? Yo, what, what are you talking about? I'm talking about good. That's what I'm talking about. First one's on the house. 
I got things to do. Oh, where do you think you're doing? I'm going downstairs. Oh, there's a toad in the hall now. Ten bucks. Look, I... Oh. I just... Oh. Stewie. Oh. Look. Oh. Come on. Oh. I... Oh. Just... Oh. You... Oh. This is... Oh. Come on. Oh. Ah, I'm just messing with you, man. You can do whatever you want. I was just kidding you. Why are you so serious? Nothing you need one. But here's one more reason to watch Family Guy on TBS. Huh? Brought to you by Mitsubishi Motors. It's time to head someplace new, wherever that may be. The all-new 2014 Mitsubishi Outlander with advanced safety technologies, 31 miles per gallon and room for seven. It's never been easier to find your own lane. Life likes to challenge us. how much we can take because life just wants us to be ready for anything this Tuesday bring home the most visually stunning movie of the year on Blu-ray oblivion is unlike anything you've ever seen Tom Cruise Morgan Freeman this is just the beginning if I can talk to anyone as much as I want to here, I must say, Woof, it up. Then why am I limited when I make international calls? Exactamente, amigo.